what up what up what up this is mike the philosopher here with another one this one is support court y'all uh title mom left five kids this is the update let's go in support court with judge von de b is now in session judge's case number jvb1084 daniel's case thank you you're welcome you all may be seated all right mr clough yes you you're are. back except today you're the petitioner. Looks right. like we found mom. Finally found her. Okay, finally found her. What can I do for you today? Well, Your Honor, I'm here to get some justice. I think it's time that I get back what I've been giving out. What do you mean by that? Money. I've been giving so much money and she hasn't even been here. Right. You know? Well, well, before we really get started, are the kids in the car with the dog again today? The kids aren't in the car, Your Honor. The dog got hit, so he's in a doggy wheelchair. Okay. So. All right, well, yeah. I'm sorry to hear that about the dog, wow. but the kids are fine. They are, they're with the neighbor. Okay, good, good. Just wanted to make sure. So, what's been going on? I mean, it's been a few months since I've seen you. Right. So, it looks like you were here. Don't, Back when you were here, they like had that. a, excuse me? Is she just looking at me crazy. <laughs> I'll make it easier for you. You focus on me. Right. Focus. Don't focus. Excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry, Judge. Don't be sorry. Just don't do it. This is your he first time here today. And if I remember correctly, you filed the lawsuit on him previously and I had did. the audacity not to show up. So you definitely need to pipe down. Okay. Okay. I chose money, though. I haven't seen this before, but is she chewing gum in court? She come out, uh, I don't know. Um, again, I have not seen this before. I haven't seen the previous one either, but uh, so I'm catching up with everybody else. Um, let's, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna make any more comments. Let's just, <laughs> uh, let's just go back in. Okay, <laughs> well. You may have, and we're going to get into that and see how much money you probably are going to be paying on child support, but we want to, oh my gosh. You see, you see, see? God don't like ugly. Oh, <laughs> you know what? And then, he, you talking about you? God today. don't like ugly. <laughs> you know, this happens every now and then when the mm. weather is bad outside. No, Things happen the in court. And well, no, the weather is bad that outside. She got. You know what? Talk okay. to the judge. Don't direct nothing over him. Okay, what she just said is right. All right, but I'm not agreeing with you in the sense that, you know what I mean? Let me tell him to be quiet and talk to me only. I got All right, judge. Mr. Clough, continue. So as I was saying, it's been a few months. So the kids have been with you, looks like it's been about seven or eight months now. Yes, you are. All right, so in this seven and eight months, seven or eight months has mom been paying? Have you been paying? Well, no, no, that's not how this works. Uh, that's not how this works. She hasn't been paying. All right. She has not been paying. Has she at least been visiting with the children? She hasn't visited the children, but she visited that man in jail that she ran off with. Wow. Oh, the one that was in the the, the car that you in really couldn't list, see? Yeah. The cutlass. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's yeah, right. He got arrested not too long after I saw you for the PPP loan. Is that correct? No. That's how that she got incorrect. that. That's incorrect. That's incorrect. She got what? What's that? You know, from the last time. She got the the booty in, in the booty. What they, they they call it something though. Uh yeah, the BBL. She know. Oh. Why are you telling my business? <laughs> People need to know. People don't need to know nothing. That's for the ground. Anyway, Your Honor. <laughs> I mean, I want it. I know I question whether or not this is a skit or not. I, I don't know if it is or not. This chick can't be serious. She up here chewing gum, uh, you know, just, I mean, just not making a very good representation of, uh, you know, a black woman. Um, Vonda B makes an excellent example of a black woman, let me say. Um, Love Vonda B, but this chick on a on a stand or or the 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 defendant uh, ratchetness. She going to visit her man in jail who got arrested for PPP loans. Probably stole that money from the government to buy her BBL and her tatas. So 
she gonna go visit him, but she not gonna go see her kids. I cannot wait to hear the rest. Let's go. To know, but you know, we're not here for that. We're not here for that. I'm not right. gonna be petty. So, you are seeking to put mom on child support. I am. All right, and health insurance. Who's covering? Well, I would assume she's not. Are you covering health insurance? Or are they on Medicaid? What's going on? Well, I wasn't at first, but I got a promotion at work. All right, congratulations. I appreciate that. All and, right. And maybe a manager at, at the McDonald's. So I'm making a little bit more and I was able to put two of the kids on insurance, but not all of them. Okay. Just can't cover that many. So. All right, so the other ones, what are they doing? Uh, well, my other job kind of covers that as well. Okay. All right. So at least all of the children are insured. They are. All right. How much is that insurance total for the kids only? On McDonald's or the other job? No, just in total. Oh. Uh, it's about three fifty. Three hundred and fifty dollars. Okay. All right. Is there anything else you want me to know before I move over to her? Uh, I think that's about it, Your Honor. Just ready to hold her accountable. Okay, boy. Okay, um, let me tell y'all a sh short story. Hit the like for this story, okay? Hit the like, hit the like, hit the like. It's not, it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal story, but um, there was, um, I, I, I think I'm in a group uh, on Facebook, right? And there was a comment that okay the question no 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 it was on youtube it was on youtube i think it was one of those uh groups um uh the tonight's conversation or something like that y'all probably know who i'm talking about probably don't but the video showed a woman and and the question was what is a high value man I got into this conversation and I said a high value man is a man with money. Um, and it doesn't matter who he sleeps with. It doesn't matter. Okay. All kind of women had problems with that comment. <laughs> So I said, okay, like future, like Nick Cannon. This proves my point. Women care about money, lifestyle, and status way more than they care about infidelity. Now, why am I bringing this up? I'm bringing this up because this chick right here seems to be a chick who is kind of proving my point she went after the scammer ppp guy who probably had a lot of money to flash and looked like a high value man this is that's another thing i said women will go after drug dealers and scammers okay way before they go after mcdonald workers and things like that integrity morality none of that stuff really matters stop playing stop playing the things that matter is the and, and some of the women were like no nah, future ain't no high value man nick cannon ain't no high value man well why do they got so many women lining up to have a baby why high value is determined by the opposite sex it's not determined by you most women even this chick the defendant don't view her baby daddy as a high value man that's why she ain't with him no more she valued the other guy who had the ppp on the scammer 
I mean, he bought her a button, some tatas, but still. So when when guys say, look, nice guys finish last, good guys finish last. This is what we're talking about. This guy got two jobs. He worked one at McDonald's. I don't know where the other one at. He got all of the kids. He's paying insurance. She could care less. She'd rather go visit her jailbird in jail who was a scammer and scammed the, the government out of PPP loans. That's where her value, that, that's, that's what she values. I seen an interview with Dr. Umar Johnson. He said, oh, well, we got to do our best. Of black men ain't been black men for a long time. We ain't, that, that is complete bull, bullshit, okay? This is a perfect example. Again, I don't think this is a skit. I'm treating it as if it's real life. I don't think it's a skit. I think it's real. But even if this is a skit, there are real life situations out there just like this. This is why I respond to it as if it's real. Because there are real life situations out, out there like this. Women will go after bum ass dudes scammers drug dealers pookies ray rays and not deal with good men and they wonder why we're in the situation that we are in to dr umar this case right here is just one of many to prove your theory wrong that black men is the problem this is just one case. It ain't the it ain't the men. I'm not saying it's all the women because there are some bum ass dudes out there. But chalk this one up for the men. This case, let's go in. Okay, Miss Daniels. Yes, Jed. Sorry. Excuse me. Excuse in me. World. Jed, sorry. Are, are you here to be pretty? Or are you here to tell me your side of the story as to why? you shouldn't pay child support today. A little bit of both, Judge, but I'm Well, I'm not interested in whether you're here to be pretty or not. That Facts. has nothing to do with my ruling. You understand it, right? I do, Judge. All right, but so I should be. Talk to her, Vonda B. See, this is a great example of a, a sister, is Vonda B. Talk to this woman. Let her know decorum is needed in the courtroom. You know, be presentable. You ain't got to have your tie tie spilling all out. Do you even have a shirt on under that? I don't know. And you got this leash on your neck. I don't. The, the issue is. We I, I would say this. We have about a 50 50 mixture of both these women in the black community. 50 percent of Vonda B's 50 percent of Keisha from around the block. The Vonda B's need to talk to these Keishas, for real. Let's go in. Pretty funny. Well, let's stick to the facts. I could care less how you look. Okay, Judge. Let's get to the facts. Please do. The and, fact and quickly, is. And quickly, without, without all the extra. Not, not extra, not extra at all. The fact is, Judge, I had these children for 10 years before I put them on your doorstep. He was barely doing anything. That's why I petitioned the court, Judge. Okay, well, here's the deal. You petitioned. Yeah. He showed up. You he didn't. Did. I dismissed I had it. had an opportunity, Judge. Had to take it. Okay. And could you do me a favor? Could you, Spit out if you're gun. going, I, I don't allow gum chewing, but if you don't have anywhere to put it, I would suggest you at least. I'm mm. good at that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Now you see. What? <laughs> Mr. Clough, <laughs> Ms. Daniels, continue, please. Well, that's why I petitioned the court. I do apologize for not showing up, Judge, but let me tell you, I came up, <laughs> you know? Oh, I let's talk about this him. come up. What kind of come up are we talking about? Well, Judge, I met a man who said he can change my life, Judge. Mm. All right, so how financially, mm. you know, huh. did he change this life of yours? Not too much. Oh, oh yeah. Mr. Clough, Mr. Clough. <laughs> We don't know. Let, let's hear her side of the story because I'm pretty sure she's going to say some interesting stuff about finance. Mm. Judge, Clough don't know nothing. Listen, understand, 
that I got at least, you know what I'm saying, six figures in the bank. Oh, okay. <laughs> Had you know. six figures in the bank. You said what now? Mr. Clough. Again, I'm take not, it, I excuse me, Miss Daniels, yeah, when I speak, don't hurt your own both case, of you bro. be quiet. Mr. Clough, there will be no more outbursts, okay? I understand you both are frustrated, emotions are high, but let me get through this hearing, okay? Because if I can't get through it, guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna reset it. And I know you, neither one of you wanna pay for court parking again, right? I don't. You don't wanna take off your work, right? Only one of us will be here. <laughs> okay, but you want some sort of relief, right? Yes, sir. Okay, so in order for me to do that, I have to hear the facts. Now, Ms. Daniels, again, yeah. continue. So, like I said... No, let me direct you really quick. You're getting ready to talk about these six, six figures. figures you have in the yeah. bank. Yeah. All right, how much money are we talking? We talking about, you know, three, four, huh? You know what I'm saying? Bullshit. <coughs> Sorry. She said no more outbursts. I was covered. I'm sorry. It's true. It's your allergies? Yeah. Handle that. Handle. You need some tissue? No. No, thank you. Okay. Ms. Daniels, that's what you have in the bank. How much money are you making annually? Well, it kind of just depends on the year and how many promotions I get, um, how many companies want to invest in me. So it just depends. Anywhere between... When are you going to answer my question? Judge, that's a, it's a difficult question for me. Because, you know, sometimes I can have a promotion that's 500 bucks, or I can have a promotion that's 50000 It's a difficult question, Judge, because, you know, with my OnlyFans, sometimes I only make 500 and sometimes I make 50000 Depends on how many lo people log on to my OnlyFans. That's really what she want to say. Okay, the only way to make uh, those kind of bands is, is, and she don't look like nothing professional. I'm going to tell you right now. I'm going to just keep it a buck. So, let's just be real. Scammers, PPP loans, she, she doing OnlyFans. Sometimes... It's a five hundred dollar day. Sometimes it's a fifty k day. Depends on how many people log in. Anyway, let's go in. Plus, so Miss Daniels, you know I don't have a lot of time, right? I have other cases I need to get I, here. I, I do understand that. Right. So you obviously came here to waste my time. I didn't. You did because I asked you a very simple question. Yes, on average, I have a simple answer. On average, on average, how much do you make in a year? Judge, I'd like to say about, uh, maybe about thirty to a hundred k. Okay, thirty to a hundred thousand. Yeah. So we're just gonna take the high end so we can keep this moving because you came here to waste my time and I do not have time to play oh with you. Oh my gosh, Judge. Um, and is this from an employer or are you self-employed? I what am self-employed. All right. I, I, I do influence. Uh, what do you influence? Only I influence fans. The world. You clearly aren't influencing. <laughs> you, you said the world? The world. Well, that doesn't include these five children because you don't even go and see them, right? It's just been the last couple months. Well, okay. no, no, excuse me. Excuse me. Yes, sir. You're influencing everyone but these children that you do not have anything to do with and you do not financially support. You said they were with you ten Excuse me? It's hot on what are, what are we doing here? What are we doing here? It's getting hot. She's trying here. to show you what she has. The BBL? Done. Yeah. I'm not interested in the BBL. Let me tell you what I'm about to do. I'm about to make these numbers go BBL, okay? Just, so just, can I can I speak briefly? Briefly. Make it quick. Quickly, um, in the last few months, it has been a downtrend due to inflation and all that stuff. People aren't paying as much. How um, much was your BBL? I didn't pay for that. That's How much was that. it? Totally. How much was it? Man, you know, I got more than the BBL. I had tube sock titties, so I got the booties, then I got the booty. Then I got Let me make something real clear here. Okay, let me just make something real clear to everybody. Oftentimes, I pick these videos at random. I'm going to just be real. I have a very tight schedule. Um, I don't want to make it seem like 
I'm picking videos that make women look bad because I'm not doing that. I pick videos that are very random. What looks interesting, you know, look at the title, whatever. Mom left five kids. Uh, I'm not trying to make anybody look bad. The men look bad. When the men are bad, I, I let them know. When the women are bad, I let them know. Anybody can get it. I just don't want people to think that I'm trying to make women look bad. But her, she's making sisters look really bad right now. Don't know how true any it is. Look, look. This is based, I will say this is all based on a true story probably somewhere, <laughs> okay? It's probably based on a true story somewhere. And this chick is a piece of work. I'm gonna just say, let's go back in. I got all that, so he probably paid 35, 40. $1,000. Yeah. Oh yeah, let me hurry up and get you out of here with these yeah, numbers. You are about to pay child support. You have five children total, or do you have other children outside of these five um, that are under the age of 18? No, I don't. Okay, They're grown. so just the five children, right? They're grown. How All are right, you? so five, children, five yeah. children, that is going to be at the 40%. Wait a minute, you got grown. She don't look that old, but if she got grown kids, you probably popped them out very young. But you close to 40 and you doing only OnlyFans? Is that what we looking at? Is that what we talking about? You close to 40 and you're doing OnlyFans. I mean, everybody knows it's OnlyFans. She didn't say it, but... You know, everybody knows that's what it is. Uh, let's see. Let's see the judge what she handed this chick. Um, can't wait to see how much she's gonna end up paying. Let's go. And you said health insurance was about three hundred and fifty dollars, right? Yes, sir. Mm. All right. So your child support you're looking at monthly. So with your testimony being on the high end of a hundred thousand dollars, that's what I just based your um, child support off of. She proud too. So, I mean, well, I was going to make it higher than that and do it like the 350,000, then that would make you cap out, but. I think you should do that. Well, <laughs> no. If she, I have to accept her testimony is true, but I don't really think that it's going to help her too much because her child support is still going to be pretty hefty. So I have your gross at $8,333.33. That brings your net to $6,512.07. So $6,512 times the 40%. That brings your child support amount to $2,604. Is that a week, Your Honor? How often <laughs> are you paid? Are you paid by the day? You pay by the month? How are you paid? Judge, it just depends. Um, I would she just though, answered my it, question. That's a monthly amount. I mean, that's How great she's monthly. paid, that's, it'll just break down, but the amount is $2,604 plus. I can give you that. Plus. You need it. Sorry, sorry, sorry. $350 reimbursement for the children. So that brings your monthly rate to $2,954. Can the kids stay with him though? That's right. like the kids that. will continue to live with him because that's, that's who they live with, and obviously and you, you care more about a BBL than them. That's right. not true. We don't know when she's gonna run off again with the next guy. No next guy. I'm good. It'll be a caprice this I'm time. Good. Oh, okay. So we're good with the numbers then. Is there anything Great. further? All right. Is there anything further that you want me to know um, that's related to this? Judge. Um, Briefly about uh, visitation. How does that work? The kids are going to stay with him, and you guys are going to work that out yeah, at a different. Don't get along very well, as you can see. Well, obviously, but I mean, they need to stay with him and probably see you on weekends if you're so busy. That's my busiest time, Judge. I can't do weekends. 
Maybe Monday to Tuesday. Well, they go to school. All right, and I'm at work. Are you going to get them to school? No. I can't. You can't get them to school. She don't I have can't. a car. What? You don't have a car? She oh, make all please. that money. Oh, you you a lie. But I ain't got no car. You better go see the rose outside. <laughs> what kind of roses? I love roses. What color? I just said rose, like uh, rose gold car uh, color. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, because yeah. I know we weren't talking about that other one. But oh, no, anywho, that's good. neither here nor there. Is there right. anything further, Mr. Clough? I think that's all, Your Honor. All right. Well, if there's nothing further, you all are dismissed. Thank you. Thank you, Judge. You're welcome. Yo. <laughs> I'm not going to look. What do y'all think of whole, this whole thing? I'm not, I'm not going to even comment on this. This is... uh. This is too much. This is kind of too easy. It's a layup. But, you know, never mind what I think. What do y'all think? Put it in the comments. Uh, I just think that uh, she said Rose. I don't know if she was talking about Rose Royce or or whatever. Uh, she just seemed to have no problem paying the 3K a month. That's good. <clears throat> uh, pretty much disowned five kids because she loved this this only fans more um and love getting attention from other men more again the future would say she belongs to the streets put it in the comments what y'all think hit the like share and subscribe i will catch you in the next one Peace. Because you came here to waste my time and I do not have time to play oh with you. Oh my gosh. Um, and is this from an employer or are you self-employed? What do we do? self-employed. All right. I, I, I do influence. What uh, do you influence? Only fans. You clearly aren't influencing. <laughs> you, you said the world? The world. What else?